want to make a very quick video on some of the figures I just received and you guys can pick for me which one you would like to see first. Alright, so for the first figure we have over here is the Vulcan Log Seto Kaiba and this one is the Yu-Gi-Oh! movie, the Dark Side of Dimensions version. I'm um, not sure about this one, it does look pretty good but the joints does look kind of annoying though. I think they're using um, the old school reveal tag joints, we're gonna find that out a little bit later. Um, Yu-Gi wasn't too bad but Knowing that Figma is releasing a Kaiba, I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep this one around, but we'll see. But for now, he does look really nice. All right, so next up, of course, we have the Blue Eyes White Dragon to go with Seto Kaiba. But to me, this one is more like a luxury goods. Like to me, this is more like an accessories. Uh, it does look pretty good, but he is kind of on the smaller side. They're they're not meant to be big, anyways, or else it would have cost me a fortune. But um, yeah, I I don't know about this one. But it's, it still looks pretty good. Alright, so next up we have the Captain America Civil War Ant-Man. And this figure is as simple as it gets. I'm not even sure if I'm going to do a review on this one. Because he literally only came with like one pair of interchangeable hands. And that little small figurine. But we're still going to do it. But it, it is what it is. Um, you can justify if you want to spend like $55 on this. It is, you know, by far still the best articulation or whatever in this scale. But yeah, it still looks really good and though. Next up, we have another Star Wars figure. And this one is Luke Skywalker uh, from the movie A New Hope. And yeah, it does come with a fair amount of accessories. And we are going to take a look at this one for sure. And yeah. Alright, so good. lastly we have the SH figure as Ultraman, and I don't know too much about Ultraman, but this one does look pretty good. Um, do let me know in the comments if you like Ultraman, but um, growing up as a kid, I was more of a Power Ranger guy. So this might be my first and last Ultraman figure, depending on my budget, because those bad guys that they're coming out with doesn't look too appealing to me. But yeah, um, I think that's it for my um, new figures that come up. I also have the SH figure as Brawly, but this one is pretty much this, exactly the same figure as the ones before. So I'm probably not going to open it But do let me know in the comments Which figures you would like to see next And until then I'll see you guys in the next video Peace